I have had many people request by commenting on my videos and DMing me on Instagram to make a video to Dr. Shivers. Now, there was one person that said, oh, it's a prototype. It's not a prototype. This is actually the very rare newer 2011 release that was sold at Grandham Road for $250. He actually does have quite a few upgrades and quite a few downgrades. The upgrades, that is, is that the gloves aren't uh, aren't latex, so they aren't going to dry up, but they're um, fabric. They're, he's We've had him since he came out. He's had a rough life. He's fallen over so many times. He's been to a crazy amount of events with the fire department, the police department, all these other things. My dad works for the city, so pretty much everything that I have has been used at least three or four times in my town's events and crap. Um, his beaker snapped off uh, two or three years after we got him. The tie's not original. It's been there. He had a pink tie like what's on my monster like that, and it bled on him. And he is all duct taped in there because from one time when he fell over, his head completely shattered. Um, some of the differences are, are, of course, the gloves being different. The eyes are yellow and the eyes light up when the mouth moves, but the eyes do not work anymore. They do not light up. Um, this stretches out way easier, so it d does not have any elastic left in it. It does not have any of the controls on the back. These things are way cheaper quality. It got wet once and it corroded instantly. And the boots are, uh, are fabric. He's very dirty, sorry about that. And the controls are here, like for the microphone, the auxiliary, and the volume. Those are not there anymore. And of course he has the feature, the on off, and sensor mode, the nine volt 1500 milliamp adapter. Got the Velcro thing in the back. You can see a lot of the duct tape on his thing but yeah other than that i've never had any issues with him no splitting gears yet well other than the fact that his issues was the that he fell over and shattered but yeah i'm gonna flip him on so i don't have to keep stepping on the button uh, a visitor please make yourself comfortable you're going to be here for a while <laughs> I need a volunteer for a little uh, experiment. Side effects may include nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, and a slight loss of vital organs. His hair's getting kind of out of whack. And I forgot to mention, I bought him along with Heads Up Harry and the Coffin Rising Vampire from Grandom Road. And my grandma has that weird witch from SVI, the one that says hocus pocus, please don't crocus and all that. Yeah, my grandma has that one. Let's play a game. I call it fun with electricity. <laughs> Ever since the incident, I've not been quite the same, except for my shocking personality. <laughs> I say, anyone have any batteries? I'm feeling a bit, 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 bit drained. Ah, a visitor. Please, uh, make yourself comfortable. You're going to be here for a while. <laughs> I honestly don't remember what phrase I started on, so uh, I'll play them three more times and then I'll be done with the video. I need a volunteer for a little uh, experiment. Side effects may include nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, and a slight loss of vital organs. Quick, I, I need a victim. No, I, I mean, I, I need a guinea pig. No, I, 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 I mean, a patient. Oh, just somebody lie down and close your eyes. I know. Let's play a 
play a game. I call it fun with electricity. <laughs> Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, rate, comment, and subscribe. Now, I gotta dig out Evil Scientist because somebody requested him. And I think while I'm at it, I'm also gonna do the Maniac. So yeah, stay tuned for those videos. <laughs>